Hello everybody, welcome Ricardo, Jose, Vivek, William, Wally Lapointe. Well, uh, we'll actually see what we uh, we did this tournament. Um, wanted to do better, but uh, yeah, we always want to do better, right? The I don't really care about the, the tournament. It's uh, I hope I'm gonna get one gold. It was uh, one hour before the tournament, I was still uh, first there. So I'm gonna start with the worst <laughs> first, which is the uh, Bobzilla account. I uh, I screwed up badly, uh, especially on the back nine. I just got uh, one eagle on hall, uh, hall 11. And uh, besides of that, Nothing. <laughs> oh, really? Nice. Nice, Vivek. Nice. Congrats on the gold, by the way. 
So, minus 28. We got with minus 28, uh, 73rd position, which is uh, <laughs> amazing. Uh, one year in the past, this uh, this score was getting gold. <laughs> not not now. So this is the the banner. Still looking good. Your first ever gold banner on Gold Clash. Well, it's time to come up to pro and uh, actually get some uh, some guides and. Uh, Try to actually go, go and follow them. Definitely, uh, this guide that we did uh, now was uh, absolute money. We dialed in every single shot. We spent a lot of time to do that, but uh, yeah, you still need to execute. Big Mike, how are you doing, buddy? So B52 there, or not? Just some katanas on this one. Not a surprise over there. How are you doing, Dan? Welcome, buddy. So after this, um, this chest openings on this uh, account, I'm gonna show you how to uh, actually play uh, with rapier and with uh, with firefly. Jackie, how are you doing? Thank you for the donation. Get some booms, booms for uh, Miss Jackie in the chat, please. Okay, so Bobzilla account done. We're gonna go now, I think, to... Well, let's go to Baradu Free, since uh, I already seen the result. Um, because I uh, was watching Rock and uh, he was... Uh, we were together in uh, Free Clashers clan and uh, I just got the spoiler, so uh, there's no... Uh, nothing here <laughs> that surprised me. Fourth place with minus 31, uh, one more, minus 28, minus 28, I got uh, 15, 14, so uh, one more drop and this would have been the gold. On this account, Ironing Gopher Golan. Welcome, buddy. So, uh, top 10 banner with this one. Nice and shiny. You unlocked Firefly today. Nice, Vivek. So, we're gonna uh, play uh, with Firefly and with Rapier some friendly games. Just to set up uh, near the fringe or a bit uh, further away from the fringe to try max distance, uh, mid distance, and uh, show you guys guys how to play it. If you don't uh, like the uh, end bringer rule or you want to adapt uh, for a different thing, thorns. I love thorns. I want them maxed out. Not so much Apache. Just Dale loves Apache. Some clothes. Houdini cards. Hammerhead. Hammerhead is not bad. Not a bad club. Oh, two. Uh, two epics. And an off-roader. Off-roader is good. Uh, at one level, it will be replaced by... Uh, the Nirvana will gonna be replaced with the off-roader. BMRD, how are you doing? Welcome. Party King make a curse. And some uh, more Zergs. Not that this account needed. But uh, this was my uh, rookie. The rookie account that moved to Pro. So I'm uh, good with that result. Okay, now. Let's see what uh, we did on uh, Neo's bracket. Needed uh, two more drops, and they were there. We missed it. Got a wonderful minus 18 front, and a uh, terrible, uh, I think, uh, 14 back. Yeah. So, we got fifth position with this one. Neo was uh, teabagged by uh, Spoon Aces. <laughs> so. 
I wanted to try to uh, be that guy that was on top. 30 uh, on the opening, 14 on qualification. If I had those two drops, for example, 1 and uh, six, uh, 10 and 16, I would uh, be in the top here with uh, 15, 33 and 34. Still a uh, decent score. I'll take that score in every single day. And... Uh, doesn't really matter where I'm gonna be at. If I'm at fifth place on this uh, bracket, I prefer to be, uh, you know, not the first on a on a bad bracket, or not on a on a on a good bracket where the score it's uh, not competitive. But I prefer to uh, to have like beasts in the in the bracket and then try to compete against them. How are you doing, Simon? How are you doing? What is this rapier rule? It's uh, using the endbringer rule for the rapier? No, Angels, then. We're all gonna see it in uh, after I'm finishing with the um, chest openings. Maybe we, you can uh, actually invite me for a game and um, I can explain you while we play. So, 1300 clan points. Not bad. Some runners. Rodrigo, how are you doing? Some Desert Storms. Quarterbacks. Razors. Nice. Close to going uh, max there. This one as well. Rock, come on. Oh. Need 30 more rocks. So if I have... Uh, I need just one Prism Chest for a rock to be able to uh, max. Max it out. Sahara cards and B52 cards. Well, Sahara is not that good. How are you doing, Kane? Welcome, buddy. Party Kingmakers. So we get some Kingmakers back and some uh, Zergs back, which is always good. Let's uh, open some chests. Some Offroaders again there. Thorn, we already have it maxed out. Boomerang cards, we don't like that. So let's... Uh, I hate when I have uh, an upgrade here. Let's well, upgrade it to C. So it gets more power, it gets more topspin, and it gets more uh, ball guard. You cannot compare it with a Houdini maxed. From the sand. Just saying, power, courtesy, topspin, backspin, curl, ball guide. <laughs> Sahara not level 5. Yeah, I will gotta win all the tournaments with that Sahara game. Holy shit, right? <laughs> well, I don't think I have any uh, epic level 6 on this account. Oh yeah, I do. The Kingfisher is level 6. So... But that, it's lacking ball guide, so it's not good to play until level 7, I guess. And that's pretty much it for... Uh, oh, and the Horizon. The Horizon level 6 is the best. 4.3 ball guide with 100% uh, top spin and a lot of power. Good! Let's see, maybe we have a Prism chest here. Oh, uh, we did open it in the morning. Okay. So... Symptom down, Bobzilla down. Let's go to my main account. This was also a poor score. All the good clubs, except the Symptom, of course. Oh, this one, I didn't even play it. I didn't even enter the tournament with it. Too many accounts. Oh, we have Sebo, Sebo as well. So let's see what the Sebastian account did with the minus uh, 32, I guess. 24 cat cards on one of my expert and jumped from level 3 to 4 directly. So Sebo's hold for top 10. There we go. Got a tiebreaker against this guy with uh, the qualifying rounds. Minus 15. He had the same minus 30. But managed to get the top 10. I'll take it. Let's see what uh, Sebastian's account uh, earned. 
he was lacking uh, kingmakers. We uh, depleted all of them. This is the account that uh, was uh, actually uh, getting the notes uh, from. This is the account that played the round in 11 hours. Close to 1k uh, of plant points. That's fine. Some darts. Sand lizards. Skewers. Thorns maxed out. Sahara. I think it's the Sahara day. How are you doing, morning? Hope you are have a great day. Well, I had a great day. It's already uh, close to being finished. Thank you, sir. And bring your cards. Those are lovely. Thirty kingmakers. I just had nine left and eighteen zergs. Okay. So Sebastian's account uh, lost uh, in two tournaments uh, 10,000 gems just for um, just for practice tokens. Okay, we have a prism chest. Now we open it on this one as well. We have Endbringer in the shop, but we don't care. So let's go. Which one? Rather two. Let's go around the two account and see what uh, this one does. Uh, if you want offer, yes, for sure. If you want to have uh, that thing again. Rather two got the goal, look at that. 31 on the opening. Easy break, uh, the easy bracket here. So, guess the epic on this one. <laughs> Bam for the gold. I was uh, wondering if I would uh, place the banner, the gold banner over there. And uh, now I will have the gold banner on this account. You had minus 32 also and nailed the, the bracket as well. Nice. Congrats, Morty, on the gold. Bam. So another banner is gonna come up there, up there actually. Goldy, shiny looking banner, look at that. Nice Ricardo, nice, nice. 2500 plan points. So, guess the epic. You know the rules, the guys that uh, are not guess, not the... Uh, Getting the one, the the epic that is here, we most probably gonna have to. We're gonna get the timeout of five minutes. The ones that uh, are getting, we're gonna uh, put the rules on free games on uh, this week when we play the uh, tour play games. So you can play, uh, you can win with just one. You don't have to uh, nail both, so you have two chances. Definitely, we're gonna have, I guess, uh, two epics on this uh, this one. So, put your things in. Minus thirty four on expert got you second. Minus... A wrong guess of epics. You will be flushed. <laughs> okay. Exactly, Vivek. That's the rule. You're gonna be flushed for five minutes. If you don't guess it's right, let's see if I can uh, actually flush you for less than that. Now I can just flush you for one second or five minutes. So five, one second, it's not the not the thing. Okay, so let's go. Rough cutters. Don't be nervous. Muschetti. Malibu. Sixty Malibus. Okay, that those those are good. Those are good. Skewers, the club that screws you when you're taking the wedge. Houdini, nice Houdini. Snipers, getting close there, getting close. B52, who said B52? Anybody said B52? 
Currently, all of the guys that says now, Kane, you're uh, you're said uh, after, so uh, because of that, you're gonna get automatically flushed. <laughs> Ricardo, where is that? And bringer and the uh, hammer. So you didn't said uh, B52, uh, Ricardo. B53 says uh, angles. Then guys, don't say it now. <laughs> This is not rookie over. This is not rookie. This is pro. This is pro gold. And Endbringer. Some guys are saved. We have three actually uh, epic clubs. So who said Endbringer? Let's see. Uh, blah. Ricardo says Endbringer. So Endbring uh, Ricardo won. It's saved. There you go. We might have another one. Boomerang. So, Wally. Wally got the boomerang. Shame on you, Wally. <laughs> so, you guys uh, are safe. So, Wally and Ricardo are safe. Barb, I'm sorry. See you in five minutes. Same for KD. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Welcome, Nicholas. Uh, no, I just take a shower and uh, I didn't... Uh, made my hair then uh, Firefly took sorry took see you in five minutes thank you uh, for the boom for the gold there guys let's see uh, MacDilson said Tsunami sorry MacDilson see you in five minutes Steve said Sahara I'm sorry Steve you didn't got it okay no, I didn't play any rookie but, um, over there. So, <laughs> sorry for all the flushes, guys, but uh, that's the rule. Boom in the chat for the guys that didn't uh, actually um, play the game and uh, the remaining ones that are in the chat for uh, the guys that won, which is Ricardo and uh, Wally Lapointe. So, uh, congrats, guys. You have uh, free games. Yeah, that's that. this is the gold one. 35 Zergs, 100 Kingslayers, BAM! 186 Kingslayers on this account. That's a screenshot, not the clubs. <laughs> Woo. Good! That went well. So, I think we have uh, one more account. Three cards that needs upgrading. B52, look at the accuracy going up and a bit of more backspin. 98%. So, it's starting to be a good club. Currently, it's better than the... Let's compare. Grizzly has 3.8. B52 has 3.8, but uh, I think Grizzly... Uh, oh, let's compare it actually by one to one. Do I have a Grizzly? Yes. Let's do this comparison. More power, uh, more accuracy. Pretty much the same topspin here. A bit more backspin for the Grizzly, but the same ball guide. So at this point, I would say B52, it's, uh, it's good. Pro 2 Gold, congrats, uh, Sonic. Congrats. Yeah, please, you need to go in Pro. Um, I moved the, the guides in Pro. So uh, we'll see if we can cover multiple divisions, but currently uh, Pro it's our um, focus. Oh, don't look at my balls, Offer. Please don't look at my balls. It sounds uh, scary. Okay, so, Rado 3 we saw, Rado 4, I think this is the last account. You got three epics, Sahara, uh, B52, and, uh, and Thor's Hammer. I, I guessed one, Sonic. 
So this one, uh, it's the account that I was teabagged by um, by Pebbles, which is Rockwood, and Pebbles got uh, teabagged by uh, by Danny, and Danny also teabagged Neo with a minus 33 on this bracket. He got a minus 44, a perfect uh, front, and uh, not that perfect. Sahara Janglis and Kingfisher. So I got Sahara, I think. I said Sahara, right? Uh, with my minus 34, I ended up uh, fifth place on the um, death bracket. Uh, one more would have got me... Um, no, two more would have got me the gold. I needed a minus 37 uh, to get it. And I was actually uh, in a very good round to get it. But I screwed up hole 10, hole 11, hole 16, and hole 17. This is your bracket. This, are, this is you. Minus 38. I don't know who is you here. Okay. So, not so good. Top... 50 with this account. Still made all my accounts to the weekend, so that's fine. Uh, I couldn't uh, focus on too many accounts. Castaway. And that's the only epic. 15 Kingmakers, which is good. Get some back. Oh, Katanas. I didn't have katanas on this account, so <laughs> those might be in handy sometimes. So, let's see. Guardian there. Oh, getting close to the chest hoarder. Horn it here. That's gonna fill up the chest hoarder. Goliath, Thorn. Can we get it? Oh, we can get it. There we go. So, we're gonna get a chest here as well. Get some jammies. I think this uh, this one is gonna be a bit better than the, the tournament chest. Big dog! Already started good. Saturn! Very good with the backspin. The claw, yeah, the best club ever. Yeah, the best uh, the best chest ever. One Marlin. <laughs> Free practice tokens. That are those are good. So the next one, it's the one that I need actually to get. We'll see some challenges. Oh, I have this one for as well. So I need this one. Play 10 games having only hit perfect shots. Five to go. If I get this one, I'm way through that. So 500 will gonna get me also this bat over here. There was one more chest in the challenges. Yeah, I saw it. I got it, uh, Nicholas. Thank you for seeing that. He does that for perfect pot. Oh, that's easy. So, what we're gonna do now? Johnny D. Welcome, buddy. What we're gonna do now? I'm gonna switch to my symptom account. And let's uh, also get uh, you the link. For the, the Facebook account to add me as friends if you're we're not already. And there we go. Tour 12. Now we're gonna go tour 4. Um, just to uh, show you how to uh, play it. So this is the URL. For Facebook, I'm gonna pin it up there. Oh, Johnny D got the Master Gold? Congrats, buddy! Nicely freaking done! So, what are we gonna do now? You're gonna add me as friends and send me um, a friendly request. Make sure that you're gonna have them in the bag. Either the Rapier, I do have Rapier, either the Firefly. 
both of them are good. Firefly is good from level 3, so uh, don't matter it's, uh, if it's not 100 top, top spin. Do we have something else? So, uh, I'm gonna switch to Endbringer when we're gonna have Endbringer to level 7. Until that, it's a uh, rapier, it's the better club. One yard difference, but it has 100% top spin, 100% back spin, 100% curl, the same ball guide. So, those being said, that's it. Sebastian! Well, you missed the top 10 for your account, you missed the gold on one of my accounts, you missed the top 5, uh, and some other accounts. So, until you guys are um, inserting the friend requests, if you're sending any friend requests, because I'm not getting any uh, notifications, uh, I'm gonna take a short break, and uh, after that, we're gonna play some uh, friendlies to show and explain the rapier rule. Because I think while we're gonna practice, it's easier to explain. So we're gonna not gonna place the ball into the hole. We'll uh, try to get from different distances, from max distance of uh, the rapier, the max distance of the firefly, and uh, Nate. Uh, just after the break, we'll uh, we'll do it. We're gonna you're gonna send me a a different one. I'm gonna take a short break now. So uh, yeah, if you're not we're not friends on Facebook, send me a friend request over there, and uh, see you in five minutes. We are back.
Okay, we're back. I'm refreshing right now. See if uh, somebody else uh, added me as friends. Hmm. Friend requests. I have two. Two friend requests. Wait a second, Nate. Yeah, we're gonna play one with Nate, and then we'll um, we'll refresh the app for the others to um, to have a go. So let's go. Yeah, I need to uh, cut my hair. It's uh, pretty long, <laughs> or at least arrange it. As in Bringers Five and Reaper Eight. Yeah, you can use uh, the Endbringer rule for uh, all the wedges, it's not just uh, the one. So the the thing that we're gonna try here is to get uh, in wedge distance and then uh, try the shots from um, different uh, positions. This is not the best uh, one to uh, go because it has a bit of elevation at the end. Might be a minus 5 there, so instead of 20% downhill we're gonna use 15, most probably. We'll see. Nice shot. Don't go for the Audi. Because uh, otherwise you're not going to learn anything. I don't have the grids on. Let's place it. Oh, where I am. After this, oh, a bit too long. Anyway, we want to go into the rapier rule. <laughs> Can I join Discord? I will play my baby account with you uh, side. Your baby account. You need to. Uh, we're playing uh, friendlies, uh, Vivek. I'm not on Discord yet, so I don't think I'm gonna enter right now. <clears throat> yeah, symptom card has uh, pretty poor there with one, two, three Albies. Unfortunately, with uh, also four um, birdies. I think uh, from that point it's 25% uh, elevation. <laughs> so let me try to get it at the same point as you are. I don't like the green either. Play the minus 30 uh, rough clubs. <laughs> for rough clubs. Oh, you played uh, and got minus 30 and got rough clubs, Jose? So, full topspin. Go with full topspin. That's not. Don't play the endbringer rule on me. Because that's not what we are trying to learn here. I'm gonna go 25% or no, I'm, I'm still gonna go 20% here, so I have a power 0, gonna go 20, so we'll see the club distance. So I'm like 72, that's all gonna be... Uh, 
72 divided by 2 will gonna be 36. So 36%, 4.6, gonna be 1.7 rings. And that's how I play my rapier shots. <clears throat> So it's uh, pretty much the same as uh, Endbringer, just uh, with full topspin, and uh, distance is divided by 2. Uh, I cannot play you again, I accepted already another uh, invite. Unfortunately, you use the... oh. You use the Endbringer rule. How are you doing, John? So let me refresh the app to give the guys that just add me a chance for um, sending me a game request. So waiting for your friend uh, friendly games on this account. And I'm gonna go and actually change my uh, my rapier, change it to a firefly. Also, I'm gonna modify here to add it. Level 5 Firefly. Okay, who wants to try next? It doesn't seem like a shot for Rapier Rule could be playable. I've been uh, there once and full top uh, glitch rolled. Well, it didn't glitch roll for me and uh, I think uh, from that position it was actually 25%, so it's 5% downhill. Instead of 20, I would have gone with uh, 25. I went on the left side of the, the pin there. Can I have one? I have one, two, three, four, but only paid uh, challenges. Cranston, just in time to send me a friend game. Come on, guys. Nobody wants to try it? If not, the guys that uh, send me a game request, please send it again. Well, I have uh, pinned uh, my Facebook uh, account there. Still waiting, still waiting for you guys. Any tool you want, the higher wins the better. Uh, I got a gold, couple of top tens, uh, Mike. Ken Davis sent me a friend request, but on my main account, uh, um, it's a different account. You have the, you have my account uh, that we're here. It's pinned on the top of the chat. So we're going first. Okay, Vivek, we're gonna play after this one.
I'm not gonna have enough curl. So instead of that, I'm gonna go five rings over here. And try to hit a good right. Oh, too much topspin? No, that's fine. Perfect topspin. I was only tier three, uh, tier two. Yeah, I will. I was in tier three with all my accounts. Some uh, some of them have uh, very hard brackets, like uh, minus thirty nine on top. Some of them had uh, like I got the gold with a minus um, thirty two. Gonna place in uh, wedge distance. I think it plays there. It's hard to get a full topspin uh, on this uh, this hole, so this is not a very good uh, uh, very good play for that. Unfortunately, these holes are not so um, wedge friendly. Oh, nice, Sebastian. Real nice. So I'm gonna try to go here. It's uphill there. Actually, where to have a best position to uh, get the wedge? I think it's from this corner over here. So I'm gonna try to get it over there. I don't uh, know if it, uh, we can uh, go with uh, with this green. I know when I had my first uh, time opening, uh, getting the APOC card in the in a chest <clears throat> was after three thousand games on my symptom account on this one, and I thought it was. Uh, Pretty good after 3000 games. Now I have 6000 games and it's a level 5. But I didn't play too much uh, expert on um, on it, so I was uh, focusing on pro. Well, it's gonna be hard from playing wedge uh, shot over there, but uh, I'm in thorn distance. Oh crap. So I don't think... No, I cannot reach it. I'm gonna place it... Uh, let me place it over here. Yeah, let's go over there. <clears throat> Trying to be as farther away from the hole as possible. Uh, not to practice because uh, I don't need practice. It's to show you the the rapier rule and uh, if it's uh, okay for you to play it. Go with the backspin uh, offer. Don't know if it works with a. Uh... No, I think it's roll just rolls down. <laughs> yeah, definitely that was the rapier. Well, it's uh, applied to rapier and firefly, so that's why I'm trying to show it with uh, both clubs, uh, William. So if you have, uh, I think firefly starts with level three to be uh, the same. Uh, the bad thing is the wind is too low to actually uh, show a good result. So, for example, this is uh, like 30%. We're gonna play it at 50. Uh, 
And we're gonna be close to nothing, right? We're gonna be 0.2 rings. What the hell is that? Yeah, I need stronger wins to actually show you what the what I'm talking about. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, I got two chests. I cannot play uh, offer. I accepted a different challenge with uh, Vivek. Hopefully, we're gonna get a better. Uh... Uh, I think this one is good. Uh, yeah, but I'm trying to do something different, uh, Sebastian. Like I said, I. I know the end rigger rules works with um, pretty much all of them. Sure, Sebastian, I'm gonna be in the rough. Oh, even worse. <laughs> So what you have to play, yeah, I think I should uh, actually go with the basic ball just to re remove the wind, uh, wind reduction from the from the shot. Higher winds, uh, gotta be more rings to adjust. So. Okay, so I'm gonna go around here and try to have a greater distance. Maybe over 100% will be, will be even better. So we'll try with over 100%. So though that one plays 0% uh, elevation, which is uh, actually good for 20%. It's a lot less rings to adjust uh, because the currency of the Firefly is not that good. But if you have a Rapier, then uh, switch it to that. It's um, It has a, a lot better currency than the Firefly. So I'm not at uh, over 100. I'm around 90% there, so I'm gonna play at 45. Ball guy through the hole every single time, especially in headwinds. One ring. How do you decide elevation for your uh, RR? Well, 
if it's a zero percent elevation uh, normally for uh, that uh, it's flat then you add 20 percent elevation if it's more you add that elevation to that 20 percent exactly like um, like the other one check your uh, distance uh, there vivek before of the club I cannot see your full full thing over there. Uh, I definitely cannot see your full ball guide. My full. So you wanna go again? Okay. Oh, I accepted a different one? Sorry, Vivek. I accepted Sebo. I don't say the Firefly is a better club than um, uh, Endbringer. Or the Endbringer rule, it's uh, not good. But uh, it's another opportunity for, to uh, actually switch it to the Raid here. Or Firefly if you have a low level account and you don't have the Endbringer to a decent level and uh, some shots are not working for you. If you have uh, the Firefly level 3 plus, you can apply this rule. Oh, I'm gonna get a slice. This is gonna be a... counter slice. He's just messing with me. Why are you just messing with me? <laughs> it doesn't really count, uh, Vivek. If you applied or you didn't apply spins. Oh no! Good, it's not good with this club. <laughs> good, it's not good. Sebastian, it's we're we're trying to play uh, full topspin with the wedge and show the rapier and firefly rule. You don't have any rules. I'm just trying to show you how to play your wedges, how I play my wedges. So, just put it in the wedge distance and try to uh, reproduce the shot. Don't put it on the green, mofo. <laughs> He's trying to uh, place it in the hole. If you're on the green, I'm gonna forfeit. Because I'm spending time. <laughs> what the... Uh, what wedge do you have? Oh shit, I played 30 rings there. Sebastian. It's pinned on the top of the chat, uh, Jose. 
You want to uh, slice dunk it. <sighs> Sebastian is just being Sebastian. It's not. Uh, I cannot force him to play the rules. Okay, screw you, Sebastian. Okay, so, 20%. I hope I'm uh, over 100% of uh, my uh, my wage over there. Come on, Sebo. <laughs> so, uh, am I speaking English, guys? Because uh, Sebastian apparently doesn't uh, really understand English. What are you doing, man? Come on, be over 100. Okay, so here I'm at 100, right? So this is like 105%. So I'm gonna play like 53% slider. Zero point eight rings. I don't think I have it centered. Yeah. The needle is so slow here. Yeah, he doesn't hear offer. No, not coming in hot. God damn it. No, I'm not gonna play you, uh, Sebastian. <laughs> not gonna play you. Uh, let's see if somebody else uh, tried to add me. Keen Davis confirmed. Okay. Let's go in wedge distance. I had the perfect shot to get there. Sebastian, English. Can you speak it, English? Can you speak English? No, you're not. No, you're not. And this is not a rule, uh, Sebastian. It's is a different approach for uh, for getting the wedge wedge shot. And I do it uh, with the uh, with higher wins. I do it in tier, tier ten as well. So. So this one, it's uphill a bit. Are. 
I'm not saying uh, you you should uh, change your uh, Endbringer and uh, play with this one. I'm just saying that, uh, for example, when you're uh, over 100% and you don't know what to adjust, then uh, you can play it like this as well. Get ahead! What are we doing, Charles? What's up, buddy? I'm trying to get higher wins to uh, actually uh, show that it's possible with higher as well. So I'm gonna go here uh, instead of 20% uh, downhill, I'm gonna go with just 15% downhill at club. So I'm like 95% over there. So 95. We're gonna be uh, 47. Well, I threw the whole 47%, 2.8. We're gonna be 0 0.6 rings. You sending me a request as Steve, checking it now, confirmed, buddy. This is basically a variation of my preferred EB method. Find 50 or 25 of my club as I close as, then spin to the hole and uh, EB rule elevation but uh, landing spot uh, slider. Yeah. That's your, uh, that's your variation of uh, the EB method? This is my variation of, a, of the EB method. And it, uh, like I said, works with Firefly and Rapier, because these two clubs have uh, a lot of topspin. So after the game uh, with Grenson, I'm gonna restart the app to give uh, also the other guys uh, a try. So don't uh, request invites. Oh, it's a draw. I know you don't have uh, coins and uh, chests. There you go. <laughs> now I don't have coins and chests. <laughs> Just making sure I'm not getting a tour two. Tour four, it's a uh, higher wins, but uh, worse, uh, worse greens. So, for example, again, this green, Branson, uh, we cannot. Oh, this one, it's good, I guess, or not? No, this is the no bueno green for um, for playing with the wedge. What is a rapier? It's the the end bring uh, end bringer killer. Playing tour nine hole practice. What do you mean playing tour nine hole practice? You cannot uh, go with um, friendlies or something in tour nine. <laughs> Morty. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, it's a bad one, uh, Granson. Let, let me do that for you. Okay, let me restart the app. It's just... Uh, we're just... Uh, not getting any... Uh, any info about it. So let me switch back to the rapier, because it's more accurate, so it needs more uh, more rings to adjust. Maybe on lower or lower wins. So let's see who's online. Oh, I can play a practice round here. Son, son, one expert gold again. Yeah. For sure. Get a boom. There you go. Sorry. It's not the course that I want. <laughs> we cannot play a wedge here. Unfortunate. So let me actually go in uh, in a practice here. We're gonna pick a pick a course. Gotta go on expert with the basic ball to increase the wind. So this one it's expert tier three. Uh, it's uh, gonna be hard to pre to uh, to get it. So I can play this part five. Let's go with this part five. <laughs> no problem, Katie. <laughs> Every single time, just ask. <laughs> I uh, I was having full, but uh, yeah, the issue is uh, that uh, that hole didn't give us anything. Oh, I forgot me. I just gotta try to get to the green there. That can be bad or good. Yeah, just uh, yeah, you can uh, send friend requests for um, everyone. We're not gonna get the insights for the hole here. From that position, I think you're gonna be in the long iron distance, so um, harder to get. Was planning to slice hook rather before the forfeit. Oh, okay. <laughs> You need to be faster, Katie. You need to be faster. <laughs> so I'm gonna place it here.
go to a higher elevation. I'm gonna pull down a bit. <laughs> I do still have them, uh, Geta. Yes, I did uh, have the notes. Let me actually check them. Tournaments. Cursed Swamp Mini. I have uh, just a rookie on this one. Yep. Just the rookie one. I can uh, put it on um, on the drive and give you give you access if you want to uh, check them for a rookie. But we're gonna go pro. So, eleven wind. Now this is hard to uh, estimate. Elevation, it's a bit of uphill. And I'm like 90% uh, over there, so I'm gonna go 45. 5-point two rings. There we go, higher wins, 90% uh, at club, 45. No, that's fine. Works like a charm, higher wins. So, like I said, the, the rule works, higher wins, lower wins, works the same. Thank you, Solis. We don't need good luck, It's uh, we're just uh, showing um, the rapier rule. And as the Endbringer rule. Now, I was uh, just... Like I said, I was just going uh, to see uh, to show you that that also in higher winds, and uh, not just uh, if you are at uh, below 50% elevation or something like that, you're gonna get uh, get it in. It's just showing the wedge shots. Not gonna blow my uh, tokens away because uh, I will need it for the next tournament. Otherwise, I'm gonna be forced to um, actually get. Um, a frame of shame. So I might go on a tour nine. If somebody wants to snipe me, let's go on tour nine and we we can practice there all day. So everyone wants to snipe. If you're, uh, if you want to snipe, you can snipe me in three, two, one, gone. You need to be in Europe to actually uh, get me. Mr. Fly, sixty-one. Don't know if it's uh, any one of you guys. So we have the city park. Oh. Not a bad wind.
That grade won't be good. Or it might. Oh, that's good. You quit tournaments for now, her. Oh, why? Good evening, uh, PL3X. I was uh, just showing uh, another way to play your uh, wait shots, which uh, and to give a purpose for the the Firefly and the Rapier clubs that uh, you have them in the bag, especially for uh, low level players. That uh, I think those are the guys that are using Firefly, and it was works perfect from Firefly level three. And also uh, rapier. They need like um, eighty something uh, top spin to uh, actually to uh, work the rule. So I'm gonna place it uh, right over here just because we can. Perfect spot for a wedge shot. I'm gonna play it still 20% from there. So let's see, where's my uh, cursed swamp? First Swamp Mini PDF. I'm gonna update it. If you want to uh, get what I did in on Rookie as a brief, here is where you find my guide. That's the that's the guide from last year when we have the Cursed Swamp. Mimi. So let's see where we are. So I think I'm at 75%. So I'm gonna play... Uh, 37 This is odd. Okay, we have a glitch roll here So I think there it's a bit more So I'm gonna go 39 4.6 gonna be 1.9 rings I'm Gonna push them instead I had a ball guide at the hole, but it's a bit of uphill there, so uh, need a bit more slider. Was on Sunshine Glade, the mini is on Phantom Mansion. Oh, Phantom Mansion, okay. Let me search for Phantom Mansion then. Oh, that was uh, when I scored my minus 36 on my phone. Phantom Mansion, yeah, I have it. I have Pro and Rookie.
I have them. I'm gonna place it um, right away. So we have the Goliath, which is a good thing. It was like four back. Five point seven. You didn't want that great. Oh, I lost distance um, adjusting pin to a lower point. Crap. Should have none know that to give a bit of OP. Okay, winning it wasn't the purpose here. We're playing the playing and show you the wedge. Wedge's shot is Spirit Ball and Golden Shot just to uh, remember you guys. Yeah, I know, I know Sebastian. Be careful to play uh play your goal free golden shot by um by Sunday, because uh, last time Sunday was. Uh... How do you try to pair with me? Uh, you have to go and I go, and uh, possibly we're gonna match up, uh, Jose. But you need to have a similar uh, number of trophies and to play the same tour. Nice, Sebastian. Got some? Play the golden shot early. Oh, well, we're gonna play the golden shot uh, most probably tomorrow or the day after. Holy one, nice. Nicely done. I got Lolly. I'm looking at the. Uh... Oh, but on when, when it was the Phantom Mansion, we had just uh... just one wind for all the rounds. Not gonna be in a rapier over here, so I'm gonna play it like a uh, normal. Glitcher old. I might be an Endbringer. <laughs> no, I won't, but uh, yeah, that's funny. Well, I, I can do the uh, Endbringer bounce over. That was gonna be interesting. Yeah, I do have a. Um, Pro and rookie, but uh, like I said, it was just one win. So uh, I'm gonna upload that and uh, post the links in the chat for that. There's Phantom Mansion. Phantom Mansion. This is Pro. That's Pearl Phantom Mansion. Oh no, I'm gonna be at minimum distance of the Thorn.
to our little round. Okay, that's pro. Let me upload also rookie. Yeah, it's uh, EB plus 30. That was I was playing, uh, so but I wasn't in the in the right spot. So that was pro. This is rookie. And looks like I under adjusted. Maybe in this window we should have played the fifteen percent instead of uh, ten. I also added the five percent slider, but uh, didn't make any difference. Well, I did. I did a point one more. Oops. So let me place actually those links over there. In uh in one uh one sentence. So that's rookie. Let me go and get also pro. Oh, I want to place in the same freaking message. There you go. No, Solis, that's not good. Oh, it is. That's one good. The other one, I'm checking the links if they're good. Okay, thank you, Solis. Let me uh, place it up there. So if you want the Phantom Man Mansion uh, guides from uh, last year. That's what we played. Maybe we have some uh, some wins from there that we can uh, get also here. Let's open this uh, freaking uh, tour four chest because uh, don't like them. Thank you a lot, uh, Solis. Needed that. Bardupuri again. We're not with uh, the Viper. I don't know. Let me check. Big Topper. I have Firefly. Backbone. Sniper 5. No, I, it's Sniper 5, Thorn 4, extra mile level 6. Oh, and Viper. Yes. All, all freaking 7 was a Viper shot. <laughs> because uh, Sniper didn't have the backspin. That's what I had. Didn't have better clubs at that point. Worked pretty well. Got my uh, my record with my phone on on that, so I'm pretty happy.
That's a nice shot. If you don't know what uh, John K posted on uh, YouTube, look at his uh, shiny banner on uh, this last uh, tournament. Uh, that's funny. <laughs> okay, Jose, thank you for uh, being here, buddy. Oh, he missed that. <laughs> he made it with the... Oh, he, he had a Titan. I love the glitchy roll over here. Oh, I need to bounce over there, so I'm gonna reduce the top spin and we're gonna go with a bit of OP. I'm just gonna go one to one. Go a bit of OP. Maybe that great also helps. Nope, gotta be so short. That's fine. Could have uh, actually uh, place it for a uh, for a wedge shot, but I hate this uh, sloped green. Tour 9, Glide or Glizzy 7? Uh, I would say Glide because of one freaking shootout. If uh, it wasn't that shootout, uh, Grizzly all the time. But uh, for now, uh, go Glide. Only for one shootout. Gonna be better. Oh, nice, Solis. Do you have also the shootout guide uh, from uh, from us? It's not completely done, but uh, could uh, could help. There's a tour nine shootout guy, and there's a. Uh, it's not completely finished, like I said, but uh, I'm gonna. I already have it. Oh, let me uh, let me hide it from here. So there are some uh, more landing spots to be placed there, like in the whole uh, party party freebie. I already have all the wind directions closed, but I didn't place any uh, landing position. The one hole that I'm telling you about is uh, the city park free sea, and in tailwinds you'll go with the Goliath. Oh, what the hell did he play there? So we need to offset. Let me actually use the guide here. So that wind, exactly this wind, I don't have the adjustments for it. Nice. We're gonna learn something today. 10.2, we're gonna go mid, 10.7, 0 0.7, 9, one ring more, I'm gonna go with a bit more curl here, like hop a ball, let's see if hop a ball works. Tiny bit more than a half a ball, and that will gonna be in. <laughs> 
So let's uh, actually uh, let's actually use this one as uh, elevation. Of course, I played twenty percent mid here. Perfect side spin. It's always one right spin. Yeah, exactly. This is was the only win that I didn't have. So let's uh, let's look at the replay. And I also gonna post the uh, place the landing position because uh, he doesn't have it in the guide. So this is a good opportunity to actually do that, right? I'm gonna try to uh, cut the ball guide because it won't gonna be uh, for the same um, wind. So I just want you to see the landing position. So basically, what I'm looking for it's the red red ring by the rock on the right, and the blue ring. If you look straight, it's touching the rock over there. It's uh, at the rough. So blue ring, uh, red ring by the right side touching the rough, and blue ring at the top. That's the landing position. And let me. Uh, Oh, I didn't saw the spins. Let me get my cable to connect it to uh, my computer to upload the photo. So that was free, but we added more. Five back, one right. Looks good. Five back, one right. Five back. Curl just a bit more than um, half a ball. I placed it half a ball, but it needed a bit more. I think in the lower winds, half a ball will work good. No, it was five back, one right, uh, Granson. Five back, one right. It's exactly uh, the same as um, the other crosswind from uh, left to right, which I played the uh, five back, one right, but with no curl. This time we need uh, around a bit, uh, like half a ball or a bit more than half a ball in higher higher winds. What program do you use to make uh, your shootout guides? Uh, no program. I'm uh, doing it uh, on the Google Docs on my Google Drive. So I already see uh, that somebody is watching on it. <laughs> now, it, this is uh, this is created uh, completely in, uh, in here. But uh, yeah, uh, the guides that I'm doing, I'm doing it in uh, Microsoft PowerPoint. Inner circle, right curl. You think in this guide. ECRC, it's inner circle right curl. If you go on the second uh, page, you see the curl abbreviations and also uh, you have the curl reference for each single hole, each, each single curl. Well, let's uh, let's actually make a training right now. So, let's uh, because uh, a lot of you guys can start tour nine with this guide. I'm gonna help you a lot on the, the shootouts. So I am. Uh, let me cover my face a bit. So here you're gonna be at the first page, right? Uh, normally, if you click here, you will go and go directly on this page. Here on the second uh, page, on the second slide, you have the curl abbreviations. This is inner circle right curl, middle circle right curl, so this is inner circle, let me actually uh, zoom in, let's uh, use the magnifying glass a bit, more than that, so that's inner circle, 
that middle circle over here, where you see the magnifying glass. That's that's the outer circle, right curl. Then there's half of the ball. When uh, the if you have a grid on the middle, you'll see that the middle line will gonna touch the ball in, uh, on the on the edge. Then you have uh, three quarters of the ball, which is a bit more than uh, half a ball. You see the the line here and has some uh, some space between it. I think I need to zoom even more than that. I cannot zoom more than that. Control Alt Plus. Okay, so I can zoom more. Now you see uh, the three uh, three quarters of the ball. It's uh, you have some space from the middle line if you have a grid line. Then it's a uh, one ball of uh, curl with the edge. Then uh, O means outer circle. Then I have the last one, which is a triangle left curl, which is uh, pretty much close to one ball and a half. This is also uh, over here. So that's the the guide for the club abbreviations. And then from uh, from here, for example, we have this one. Normally, when you click it, you're gonna go directly. For me, because I can edit the link and stuff, it shows the link here. So if I click it, it's gonna go over here uh, on the guide, and I'm gonna go right now and uh, actually get from my iPad. Uh, after it loads all the images, I'm gonna take the landing position for uh, the one that I we took just now. Sort by uh, created. So let me copy the the image. Let me go uh, over here and do place it. That's valid for every single wind direction. And now you see it, uh, it's updated in real time. Oh, you can see me over here. Hello, guys. <laughs> it, has, uh, it has a filter added. So he didn't saw a bit of the bunker. Okay, so we added the over here also the landing position, which is good. If we find a different shot, if I find a different shot or something, I'm gonna update the guide. So this link will gonna be always updated because uh, you see some holes don't have the wind directions. This will gonna be updated once we do have them. And there's, uh, for example, this is two landing position. I have uh, placed one here. The other ones are in the middle of this uh, shadow. This one we have it covered except this one. This one we almost have it covered with the city park free. Free B need half of it done. This one, it's the Goliath shot, that's why we need Goliath in Tour 9. This one, it's a money shot. Most of the times we're gonna get a hole in one. This I didn't place the landing position. And here I did place the landing position, but uh, not covered with wind. Okay, so that's, uh, that's pretty much the scorecard in a nutshell. So, uh, I hope it helps for you guys and uh, also the others. What happened with my iPad? Oh, there you go.
it's what I played, and uh, you, you know me, if I uh, if I play and uh, do badly on the shot, I'm trying to uh, tweak the wind as much as possible to be at the, uh, at the hole, if not in the hole. We might try... No, I think it will gonna be a... Hmm. I'm gonna try the... The rough bump here. Radu is the uh, clan in now. Yes, I'm in the uh, in the Majestic Phoenix. Somebody asked for my clan? Bar? So the hyperlink with the picture is only allowed when we have edit access. No, you can click on it. And we're gonna go directly to the desired uh, desired shootout. It's uh, that's how it appears on me because I have edit permissions. But uh, for you guys, you're not gonna see that. You're gonna be directly redirected to the hole. Because time it's money. Especially when uh, you're trying to find your shootout. I think you are, Barb, aren't you? If you find yourself in here... If you find yourself in here, then you're in here. If not, you can join. We're uh, in North Germany. Thank you for the good luck. Welcome. Oh, he's uh, laying up as well for the grizzly shot. The curl wasn't enough. God damn it! Need to place more. That's fine. We can reach. Oh, Vivek! It's uh, actually uh, trying to do advertising the Team Toast too. By the way, guys, in uh, in Team Toast, where's uh, where's uh, where's Toasty? Because I miss him. Unless uh, you use a P5, you I don't think you can reach in uh, two on this hole. Yes, this is uh, always gonna be an all beagle, at least on pro and uh, pro expert and master. Oh, that's that was terrible from my point. That, that was absolutely terrible. Oh, look at that! I don't have the topspin.
I don't think it's the right adjustment, but we'll see. Nope. The wind effect was uh, a lot needed, a lot more right, uh, right spin. Yeah, but uh, with this COVID uh, situation, I'm I'm vaccinated, so I can uh, travel. But uh, don't really have time and uh, and money right now. Uh, Solis, he's in Luxembourg, right? Does any one of you guys have uh, the real address? Exactly where he lives? I don't. I was expecting uh, one of his masks uh, when he was uh, trying to do that giveaway. I didn't receive it, not uh, even until now. So uh, it's been more than one year. Easiest way to reach it's just send him a message. Okay, this one. This is an easy one. Let's uh, let's try to get it in. Tailwind. Pretty much complete tailwind. So we're gonna play here 15% max. Only in headwinds we're gonna play 20% max. In tailwinds and crosswinds 15, headwinds 20. Wittenberg. Not even close. Not even close. So, moving with the white ring until the ball guy disappears. There you go. Apply spins, one right, 2.7, low wind, I'm gonna go 2.8 here. 4.5, let's go with the uh, 5.1. And inner circle left curl, which is this thing. Let's see how close this shot is. Need a tiny bit more, very low end. For Tour 9, this is a very, very low end. I do have middle circle left curl, right? Yeah, I have uh, middle circle. Shortcut. I have the left curl placed also on the right. Oh, this is gonna last a while. I'm trying to uh, rotate all the all the curl shots for the left because we're we're showing right. <laughs> Okay, if you're on the on on that, you can see it uh, 
in real time that I'm modifying it. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I hope you guys uh, learned a bit uh, how I play my wedge shots. And uh, just tell me in the chat, was, was something like this useful for you guys? Or your um, you can play the EB rule and uh, you're fine with that. Because uh, this was requested to uh, actually be shown and... Uh, I just hope it helps. I'm trying just to help. Not trying to uh, get you, your head more messed up than it already it is on uh, some of this stuff. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sign out right now. And uh, wish you a great start of the week. And uh, good luck on your uh, golf clash. And all you do in, uh, in the day-by-day -day life. <laughs> If you have a Endbringer level uh, 7 uh, KD, you can use the Endbringer, it works the same. You just need the, the top spin to do that. Okay, later guys, and uh, have a great night. Bye bye. Turn up.